everyone welcome back to my channel I hope 2023 has been treating you well so far as you guys know I'm a cosplayer and one of my goals for the new year is to invest more into my cosplays I have been to a lot of anime conventions over the past year and I've seen a lot of amazing cosplays I've met a lot of amazing cosplayers who put so much effort and personal touch into their cosplays and it's made me want to try the same so I got this Sewing is something I've been interested in since a teenager, but I've always been too scared to try it. In 2023, we are throwing out that fear and we are committing to the craft. But before I give this thing a go, I need to take a quick trip to the store. I have arrived at my destination of Michael's. I had to overcome some driving anxiety to get here. My hands are shaking a little, but that's fine. Like I said, this year I gotta push through and I gotta commit, so. We did it! And my goal today is to get some basic supplies to carry me through my first projects. So based on my research, I made a list of what I thought I might need, and here's what I actually ended up buying. Fabric scissors, a pin cushion, safety pins, some bobbins, a seam ripper, white, beige, and black threads, a marking pencil, fabric for the tote bag, needles, threaded bobbins and a bobbins case, and lastly, a cutting mat. Okay, so now that I have my sewing machine and I have my supplies, it's time to get some practice. Since I have zero sewing experience, I'm gonna start off with some simple, basic techniques. super strong though. Okay, now that I kind of have the basics down, I want to start on my first project. You can do really anything you want for your first project, but I wanted to try my hand at a tote bag. It seems super simple to make, but it'll also be very useful in the future if all turns out well, so very excited to try a tote bag today. Okay, we can ignore the mess in the background, but I am so impressed with my cuts. <laughs> Little thing about me, precision is not my strong suit, so I don't know. I feel like I did a pretty good job. Um, hopefully, I don't ruin it with the sewing, but I guess we'll see. Sadly, I don't think I'm going to be able to finish the tote bag today because I have a little housewarming thing to go to. Um, so I might have to finish the bag tomorrow. Even though I feel like super motivated to finish today, but I got places to be, so I guess we'll just leave it off here and try the rest tomorrow.
All right, so project that should have taken me like two days has taken me like a week, but that's okay because we have a finished product and I'm so excited to show you guys. Uh, oh my gosh, okay, bag reveal. <laughs> Tote bag reveal. Um, dun, 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 dun. Yeah, it is indeed a bag. Can you believe it? It honestly, do you see these lines? Like this is pretty straight. And the, the uh, straps, they're pretty aligned. I'm so proud of myself, honestly. I'm not the kind of person that does a good job on projects usually. Usually my projects, I either don't finish them or they turn out super bad because I make a lot of mistakes and I just don't really do my research, I guess. I don't know, I just I just never do a good job on things. <laughs> that sounds so bad, but it's honestly the truth. But I feel like I did really good on this. I did make a lot of mistakes, but they were easily fixed. Um, the bag, of course, isn't perfect, and I'm sure there's like a lot of like little imperfections that you can probably see if you look closely, but you know, from far away, it's, it's great. I I'm super happy with it, and it was so exciting trying out a new hobby. I can't wait to like decorate this thing. I might put, I don't know, I might put patches on it. I might paint it or something. That would be a fun stream. Um, but it can fit my iPad. I'm gonna put my iPad inside. It can fit a book, my phone, and it's just perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. I love it so much. I definitely encourage you guys at home to try out a new hobby. It can do wonders for your self-esteem and your mood and just knowing that you created something. It's, it's a great feeling. I'm super excited to continue this hobby and learn some new skills. Are there any hobbies that you guys want to try out this year? Let me know in the comments. I would love to know. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you liked it and I'll see you next time.